Hello everyone. In the last video, um, we talked about uh, mounting uh, Windows Image backup in Windows 7. Uh, this time, it's just it's just as easy to create um, your own image that you can use as an extra drive, and you can mount and unmount uh, whenever you want. Um, it's kind of neat for like if you like to keep things private or whatever. So, right-clicking on my computer as we did last time, select Manage. Go to disk management and again we go to action and this time we go to create VHD virtual hard drive disk and browse for a location um, you can choose anywhere you can use like your C drive I'm gonna choose this drive here give it a name such as data save megabytes gigabytes or terabytes I'm going to choose uh, gigabytes or I'll actually keep this short I'll choose 10 megabytes and select OK and it's been created now it says not initialized so we have to go right click in the, 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 this box here disk 4 and choose initialize disk use the uh, default settings and that's done and now it says unallocated so we create a new simple volume so basically you want to format NTFS uh, drive letters fine you can change it to other one if you want next we'll call that data again and quick format is fine for this and you select finish formatting I don't have autoplay turned on so I'll close this and if you go to the computer you'll see oh I'm sorry yeah here data okay now the only problem is with this um, like you can have a larger one of course this is just for demonstration to keep it short as possible but the only problem is when you reboot the computer this is gone okay so it's almost like it what it does is detaches the device so I'm gonna do that disk management scroll down down to my new one detach VHD don't delete this time okay now say after you reboot and you come and you go where's my drive well, somebody's made a really simple tool. I'll give you the link in a minute uh, to go to your file that you created. Just remember where it was here. It's on this drive here, and you can right-click. It's a new shell extension, and you say attach, and you give it a second, and back to computer, and there it is. It's back and with the this add-on you can also detach from within uh, explore my computer computer whatever you want to call it so detach and there we go it's gone okay let me just pause this and I'll get the link for you okay so here it is it's uh, Meadows or Meadows homepage uh, the guy's done a great job and all you have to do is installation where it says download and you'll download it as an executable I've already downloaded it um, it's uh, you can see the X exe dot down here I'll just discard this for now remember it requires dot net framework or 2.0 but I imagine most Windows 7 users would have that added in so um, there you go just a simple way of uh, another way of uh, using the new virtual hard drive technology built into Windows 7 okay and uh, next I'll show you how to encrypt it if you don't have a uh, bit, bit locker thank you again for watching and don't forget to comment